Hey everybody and welcome to this brand new video and I'm just so super mega excited to show you guys this figure. I legitimately just got this like 30 minutes ago and I'm still mind blown by one of the figures that I got. The other one is also really good. Actually a figure I didn't expect but the Will Osprey that I'm about to show you guys is probably my favorite custom in my collection right now but let's start off with another figure which is really really cool uh, which I got and it is this Elite Finn Balor figure. And we got this uh, brand new Elite Finn Balor figure in the blue attire. Now this is an attire that Mattel didn't make. I actually have the uh, Top Talents Finn Balor in the silver attire on the way from ringside. Uh, where you can, by the way, use code NATTY to save 10% at checkout. But man, this Finn Balor right here is pretty badass that was made by angelo obviously actually this isn't finn balor that i had in my collection before then i s just sent a bunch of st uh, of my old stuff to angelo when i was moving and he fixed this balor up for me and gave it a really cool looking head scan in my opinion that looks really really damn great for a balor and then we got this custom leather jacket on it that my uh, girlfriend made which also looks really really good on it i think uh, perfect for a balor uh, way better than the mattel uh plastic vests or uh, jackets that are just like so terrible but man, Balor, here's the head skin. Here's the Balor head skin. He pretty much just has a little more beard. And then the original head skin, maybe it's a little bit repainted too. But I think it looks uh, way better than the original head skin. Then the jacket comes off here, obviously. Here we have Finn Balor without the uh, custom jacket. And yeah, it's the uh, blue attire, simply blue attire by Finn Balor. A really cool looking one. Kind of fits for SummerSlam in the blue, I think. But um, I'm not sure what attire is going to wear against The Fiend tonight at SummerSlam. But uh, we'll find that out, man. Pretty, pretty damn cool Finn Balor Elite right here that I'm glad to add to my collection. Actually, I didn't have a Balor in my collection, which is really weird. But I have the ringside one coming too, uh, which I will be uh, receiving pretty soon, I hope so. Uh, really excited about that, but now the figure that I um, am just mind blown by and we have this custom Will Osprey and it is just simply mind-blowing to me I can't believe how good this Osprey turned out now This is a figure I wanted so bad and I'm going to tell you guys why if you watch the best of the Super Juniors tournament This is where Osprey did debut this attire and wore pretty much through the whole tournament and the best of the super juniors tournament osprey performed on a level that was incredible i think 2019 is the year of will osprey there's nobody that has had a better 2019 than will osprey this guy had like i don't know six five star matches or something five plus five star matches the match with Shingo Takagi was one of the best wrestling matches I've ever seen in my life and if you say oh well, it's New Japan it's probably not that good as, as WWE is check out Shingo Takagi and Will Ospreay and you will be a changed person and you will have a hard time watching WWE so this Osprey, man, it is just mind-blowing and uh, we just, or we didn't quite finish the G1 yet. The G1 is going to come to an end tomorrow with Switchblade and uh, Kota Ibushi in the finals. But uh, Osprey had an incredible tournament, great matches. The one with Okada was probably another 5 plus star match. It was so mind-blowing. But, uh, but Osprey, even the match with Lance Archer. Uh, who, by the way, Lance Archer was incredible in this tournament. Unbelievable tournament for Lance Archer. Before this tournament, I was like, why did they put Lance Archer in the G1? But after the tournament, I was like, man, Archer was one of my favorite things in the G1. So, man, this G1 was just incredible. And it is really hard to go from the G1 and watch WWE because the wrestling styles are just in different universes, man. New Japan, I enjoy so much more. WWE isn't really giving you anything that is great match quality wise. I mean, some people then say like, oh, AJ and Seth was really good. But AJ and Seth 
was even nothing compared to a normal Will Ospreay Best of the Super Juniors tournament match. Like, I remember Ospreay having this match with Yo, who's like a tag team wrestler from Rapunky 3K, who a lot of people probably don't even know. And that match was better than AJ Seth. Like, just gotta be honest, the, the wrestling is so different and I've been watching so much New Japan this year. Actually, we've been watching all the tournaments. I've been watching them with my girlfriend. It is just, man, New Japan is on another level. But uh, coming back to Will Ospreay here, this figure is just mind-blowingly great. So we have this head skin right here. And it's a modified Christian head skin, as you guys can see. And man, Angelo did so freaking great on this. Then you can obviously see the pants, the design, how freaking great this is. I'm just mind blown, man. I'm just mind blown by this Osprey. It is unbelievable. And you know, Osprey, we're going to use this one for GCW WrestleMania. This Osprey is going to be used in GCW because 2019 usually you would always ask me who's your favorite wrestler at this time and I would say Kenny Omega it was easy for me to answer that but I think in 2019 I gotta say it's Will Ospreay because there's nobody in the world right now that has better matches than Will Ospreay it's just a fact so uh, man Will Ospreay custom elite it is incredible that Balor though is really damn cool as well just seeing these two next to each other that that might be a really cool match here Balor and Osprey but I just wanted to get this video out to you guys it's like 2 a.m. right now where I am so I'm trying to get this video out as soon as possible to you guys uh, so you can watch it before SummerSlam perhaps so uh, that is pretty much it that's all I wanted to cover hope you did enjoy the video if you did uh, let me know what you think of these customs and uh, yeah man I'm just mind blown by that Osprey. So excited. I'm still in excitement right now about this new figure here. So, uh, logging out here for today. And I catch you all in the next one.